Okay, I've got a request for Don Pedro II, Emperor of Brazil. I had to learn about him, but thank you for the request because I love history. And he's the second and last Emperor of Brazil from 1831 to 1889. That's, he reigned for over 58 years. The guy is like the bomb.com. Anyways, whew, there's good and bad in everybody, but we're just going to talk about some good stuff here. We're going to start with his head. Now, he has a very long head. He has a very European, he's from Brazil, very European look. Uh, he had light skin, light hair, light eyes. He, uh, from all the pictures I've seen. So, um, there you have it. So, we're going to start with a circle. It's a lumpy circle, but that's okay. Okay, and his face is very long. So what we're gonna do is we are going to extend that face down here because his face is long. Let's go across here. Okay, and he's looking over kind of to that side. So we are going to make his center over here and then we're gonna make his eyes right here. So we can erase the bottom part of this. We don't need that bottom part of that circle, okay? And his eyes, we're gonna do his eyes. So, they're gonna go across like this. They kind of boop, boop, boop. And we're gonna come up. And a line across the bottom. And he's got some, from what I could tell, it looked like blue eyes. I did my best here. In shiny in the pupil. Shiny in the pupil now. Okay. Um uh, his I, I might have made it too expressive his eyebrows, but uh for everything this guy has been through, we just gave him some big expressive eyebrows. We're just gonna go bloop. Little extra ones there, making his eyebrow expressive on this side. Bloop, 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 bloop. And his eyebrow is kind of it's like connected right here, and it's going to come down. And then we're just going to give him a simple little nose here. So we can erase the center part. We don't need this anymore. That be done. What else do I know? He was born in Rio de Janeiro. Mm, I want to go there someday. Someday. Yes. I'm going to go to Rio de Janeiro. I heard it's like a party place. I am not a party person, but I can still go and enjoy history. Right? I can imagine they have probably... Oh, the little mother whisper. They probably have some great parties going on. I'm going to indent this just a little bit. Give it a little character here. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. With this little cheek. Uh, he's got a fantastic. Oh, let's erase this part. We don't need this. Let's give him his mustache. Because this his facial hair is what gives him, you know? Uh, he's got this great mustache coming off the side here. And then we'll come find the middle. Bring it down. Needs a little bit more, more, more in here. Okay, and this is just like his little lip in here. Awesome. And you can end up putting in some hairs in here. Great job. Down, down. Fantastic. Love it. I think it looks great. And a little mark right here and underneath. And when you do uh, pencil it, you're going to make it darker, like a light blue, but darker at the top a little bit, and then make it come lighter at the bottom. I just did mine with pencil. Okay, it's looking fantastic. Now we're going to give... His hair kind of comes down like this. 
and it's going to come in a little bit right here because he does have his beard, his fantastic beard here. It's going to come down. Woo! We'll put some scalloped edges on there, but for now, we're just going to make it round it off so we can get the shape of it. And this is going to, his head's going to come in. And it, mm, And he does have an ear in here, but it's kind of covered up by a lot of this hair. But it's there. I see his ear. Boop. And we'll just make this come up. Oh, see, I went too far in. Good thing we've got an eraser, right? Uh, his father left when he was five years old. So his childhood. Oh, wait. He's one of, he's the youngest uh, of seven kids. And when he was five, um, his dad left. And so um, he kind of had a lonely and grim childhood. And he pretty much all they did for him is just made him study to be a ruler, which he became. But can you imagine, like, nope, you can't go out and play. You need to study. Nope, you can't do this. You need to study. Like, bummer. Childhood is the best. If I could just be in childhood the whole my whole life, bam, totally would do it. Adulting is way um, overrated, totally overrated. And I didn't take advantage. I mean, when I when I was a kid, I did not want to grow up. I'm, I knew I knew the goodness I had because I literally had the best childhood and. Pfft, I knew I was good life. It was a good life. You wake up, yeah, do a couple chores, no big deal. But then you get to go out and play. Man, hide and go seek and ride your bike. And yes, life is good. Okay, I'm just going to accentuate his hair over here. Make it look good. Let's clean you up there, buddy, because you are royalty. All right, so... We're gonna give him kind of a scalloped edge at the bottom. So this is beard, but we're just gonna not make it look so clean. So we're gonna bring this down. Perfect. And then we're gonna make some lines coming up. Fantastic. He's looking good. Looks good. All right. Um, what else? He grew up with um into a man with strong service of duty and devotion to his country and people. So I guess all that studying did the job. So we're gonna make his shoulders come out here. Good job. He grew up, um, he grew Brazil. Oh, he grew Brazil into great power. So he, he got to work. He got busy and it paid off. There's a little V right there. This is going to be his little suit jacket going on. And it's going to come out. Uh, he married Teresa Christina and they had two boys and two girls. Awesome. And he eventually died at the age of 66 in 1891. And did he die in Brazil? No, he did not die in Brazil. He died in France, Paris, France. Hmm. Interesting. Awesome. And I put a Brazilian flag behind him. Why? Why not, right? So with a pencil, I'm just going to make my flag behind here. And the, the, I love flags, um, different countries. This one's fun. It's green with yellow, and there's like a blue circle inside. 
It's a little bit of that blue circle. Anyways, have fun doing this one and I'll catch you on the next one.